Hello and welcome to the Sim 7 product update for the summer 2023 release. In this session we're going to be looking at an enhancement to the exams area to incorporate the component level results into the candidate statement of results report. So let's begin. Previously in the summer of 2022 release you may recall that we introduced the capability to import the latest XML style component results file into Sims through tools, examinations, import component results. If I was to now open up the candidate statement of results report, if I was to go to the student selection and pick up the summer 2023 cohort of candidates for the season and choose those across and update, we can now see within the setups area of the report there is a new option for the summer 2023 release including the show component results. If I tick this option, we can now run the report. On our first student, we can see that we have our normal top level results, but there are no component results for the student. If I was to skip to the next student, however, you can see the new component results section has been introduced under the top level results for the student. So if we were to look at 8700 English language, for example, we have the level five, but when we look at the component results, we can see the scaled weighted marks score for both 8700 and the two papers that have been submitted via the XML result file. This will give schools the opportunity to run the candidate statement of results report with either the top level results and equivalents, or to incorporate the new component results that have been introduced last summer onto the report as well. Further to this enhancement, if I was to now go to the student details area, and if I search for the same student again and open up the student record, if I was to now navigate to the examinations link on the right hand side of the student record, once opened, we can see that there has been a little bit of change. Where previously section one was results, endorsements and equivalents, and section two was entries and forecasts, we can now see that there is a new section 2 for component results, the scaled weighted marks. This gives users a collective view of not only the top level results for a student, but the component results as well in the same place. In the instance that a student doesn't have any component results, this panel will be collapsed so as not to take up additional room and so that the entries and forecasts can appear directly under the results, endorsements and equivalents. If you have any further feedback or ideas, please do let us know through the ESS Ideas portal or via the Sim7 Satisfaction survey. I hope this has been useful. Thank you for watching.